The biggest mistake that online brands are making with their marketing is that they are not emailing their lists enough and they're leaving all kinds of revenue on the table, easy money that is just waiting for them to pick it up. In this video, I'm gonna help you fix that. I'm Emmanuel Lea, CEO of Alea Systems, and we've made millions of dollars in email marketing revenue for our own brands and our clients' brands. And we've done it by fixing this one simple thing with all of our email lists. We send more emails more often. I'm gonna show you how. Step one is getting over the belief that if I'm going to burn out my list. People are so afraid of sending emails because they're worried that they're gonna bother their email list subscribers. That's the worst feeling. These people signed up to your email list to hear from you. So for you not to email them is actually doing the exact opposite of what they want. They're gonna be mad at you. People want to hear more from you. The example I love to use in this scenario is a dinner party. You invite people to your house for dinner, you sit them down at the table, and then you leave and don't talk to them. Why? Because you're afraid that if you talk to them, they're gonna leave. That's the wrong thing. You should be sitting down there chatting with them, educating them, entertaining them, inspiring them, chatting with them, enjoying their company, building a relationship. That's the exact same approach we want to take with our email list. We're not going to be worried about unsubscribes because if they unsubscribe, they were not going to be on your list anyway. They didn't want to buy from you anyway, right? We're not going to worry about spam complaints and all that because they signed up. If you're doing it right, they're opting in to hear from you. So don't worry about uh, they're going to leave. I don't want to send more emails. So get over that belief system that sending more emails equals people are going to unsubscribe or spam complaint and then feel comfortable getting ready to do the next step. Step two, the second of three steps is after you get comfortable with the idea, you're going to send more emails, you're going to get stuck. You're going to be like, all right, now uh, I'm overwhelmed. I have to send so many, how many emails I'm going to send? Uh, it's, I got to get into my tool, the email service provider, and you're going to open up your Klaviyo or MailChimp or whatever it is, and you're going to get stuck. Here's how you avoid getting stuck. First things first is don't write your emails inside of your email service provider. Here's what I mean by that. Instead of going to your email service provider, open up a Google Doc or a Word Doc or something else, a templated system. And if you need help with this, we have a link in my description that will help you solve for this. And just pick eight different ideas, eight different dates on the calendar, right? And then pull a script, a simple script at the top of the page that is simply subject line, preview text, content, and call to action. Put that as a little script, copy and paste that eight times on the page. And then right there, write out your emails. Eight emails for the month. Why eight? Because we want to send two out a week, Monday, Thursday, or Tuesday, Friday. Once you have that all built out, you have now separated the tech or the email service provider from the idea creative part of coming up with the ideas. You've got eight emails ready to go, and now it's time to go into your email service provider. The best part about this is you're batching. So you're staying in a creative flow. You're coming up with email one, email two, email three, where a lot of people go wrong is that they come up with email one, go into the email service provider, start making it, get stuck on the design, get stuck because they got a technical challenge or the, the website is going slow, whatever. Keep the creative part here and get all eight ideas out so you have them ready for the month. And then move on to step three. Step three, you now have eight emails already written, ready to go. The creative part is done. Now you can handle the technical side of things in your email service provider and the design side of things. Getting creative has already been finished. Now let's get technical. So take those eight emails, grab the first one, copy, paste, subject line, whatever it may be, go into your email service provider, but do not go make a campaign just yet. What I like to recommend is make a template first. You're going to create a template because we don't want to schedule it out just yet. We just want to make the email, have it ready to go. This will make it super simple to schedule them out later. So the next step is make all eight emails as a template. Copy, paste the, sub, the body text, copy, paste an image in there, copy, paste the call to action. You made a button. Boom, email one done. Do that for all eight emails. Once you finish that part, then go to the next step. You have eight templates already built, designed. You finished the design part. Now it's time for the technical part. Go into where you schedule campaigns, pick the first campaign, schedule it, select your template for that email, and boom, you're done. Schedule it for that date, move on to the next one. And with these, this process, you'll be able to churn out so many emails so fast because you're keeping your mentality in the same frame of mind and batching it instead of 
going through each one separately. So the creative part you did in step two, the design part you did just now, and then you scheduled it. Now all eight emails are ready to go for the whole month. It took you half a day and your whole month's worth of emails are done. So there you have it folks. That is our simple process for sending more emails out more often to our email list without getting burnt out with a whole bunch of work and stress and without burning out our list. It has helped us make millions of dollars in email marketing revenue. And if you're not making 30% of revenue from email, it can help you do the same thing as well. It is very lucrative. I hope that you will do it. Please use this process to generate more revenue in your business. And at any point you may get stuck and you know, you're making those eight emails and you're like, oh, I don't have ideas of what I need to make. Well, we've, we've created a tool that will help you with that. If you check the description, you'll be able to find a tool that we've created that has over 200 email ideas, complete with the subject line, preview text, body context that you can use in your own business to create your eight emails. And then you're already halfway through the process that I outlined where the emails are already written for you. And if you're not comfortable with them, just tweak it or put it in a chat GPT and get endless variations. You've got infinite emails that you can punch into your email service provider and use for your email list. So check that out in the description below. Go grab it and start sending more emails more often to your email list.